understand this thing. That God noticed that there was a woman who was able to do mighty works. Your problem as women now, you are, you are experiencing 3D makeup and 4D and, 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 and all the weave. And, and I know I'm talking to you, but, but I act like I'm talking to somebody. You take seven hours just to look at the screen. Sir, every man here, raise your hand. Fear a woman. Anyone who can remove their own eyebrows and draw new ones, fear them. says it this way women received their dead back to life not men women of the days of the bible the father will say our son is dead they say don't worry don't worry baby sit down i'm gonna bring him back i women receive their dead back to life not men women This is the part where men should just walk out because I'm here to encourage a certain woman here. There is a power. Jesus said, only these women should see my resurrection first before anybody. And then when they witnessed it, they went to the disciples and said, we, we couldn't find the, the body. They doubted it. The men, even Jesus walked with them. A long way they are even telling him their disappointment that they thought Jesus was so powerful but he was killed he had to perform a miracle for men's eyes to open but women went there to anoint him we have a wrong generation of women a wrong generation of women all you do is make up Make up and equal rights. There are no equal rights on earth. You see, here I touch you now. While it's you were busy going, Hallelujah. I said, There is no equal right. Uh. Not one equal right between a man and a woman. They are women rights, then they are men rights. Don't mix the two. You were called into your strength. Let me encourage you, somebody here. Do you understand that scientifically? A woman giving birth, one contraction is enough to kill 10 average men. 10. The pressure in one contraction, just one. Eight will be dead. The cervix opening like this. 40 will be paralyzed. Just an opening, a few inches open, if that pressure is given to a man. Now somebody told me, you need to treat women. The Bible says, treat them as what? As weaker vessels. It's not saying they are weak. The interpretation there is if I'm holding something of precious quality, I might drop it, scratch it. And I understand right now while I'm on this one, because you say, yeah, Eve messed up. But listen, if you have a boldness of a woman like Eve, that she would stand up to a snake and say, I can talk to you. Adam was not there. He said, no, I'm not talking to a snake. For Eve is like, okay, come, come, let's communicate. Let's communicate. Listen, I know, I know you have played around with Eve for a long time. Call her evil, call her everything. But imagine the first mother. He, nobody had ever been a mother before. And the woman stands there. It takes boldness. Sir. Though in an evil way, 
it, do you understand that Adam, Adam did not even know he was naked. Do you know who was first to recognize that she was naked? Eve. She got a fruit, she ate. Ah! <laughs> Fear women, fear them. God is a spirit. They that worship him must worship him in spirit and in truth. Mm. The woman said unto him, I know that Messiah cometh, which is called Christ. When he is come, he will tell us all things. Jesus said unto him, I that speak unto thee am he. And upon this came his disciples and marveled that he talked with a woman. Yet no man said, what seekest thou? Why talkest thou with her? They kept quiet. They were judgmental a lot. They said, oh, oh. Master is speaking to a woman. Notice it doesn't say to a prostitute. In those days you were not even allowed to speak to a woman. All oh, the men in here say Amen. Are you here? Yes. And upon this came his disciples. They are wondering, why are you speaking to a woman? But the woman is a prostitute. To make things worse, the woman is a prostitute. He's not allowed to speak to a woman. What seekest thou and what talkest thou with him? Mm. The woman then left her water pot and went her way into the city and said to the man, hear me well, hear me well. Come see a man. That's not a problem for me. The next statement is a problem. That told me all. No, wait a minute. We were reading the scripture. It is only one situation he addressed. But the woman said, I'm going to tell everybody that he told me about everything. I, an evangelistic power in a woman. Do you understand that in Israel, a woman's testimony was not allowed in court? And yet it is a woman who discovered that Jesus is resurrected. How God flipped the pages and said, I know you're not allowed in court, but I know your power is an evangelist. I know you talk. Nah. I said, I know you talk. Fear women, fear them. A good news world with Hubert Angel, provoking a reaction and always worth hearing.